Welcome back my comrades, I am Victor Barisov and today we are doing something a little bit different. We are on Fallout 4 doing a build challenge for Cortless VII's Discord and this is for the month of September. I just built like a theme park type thing based around Nuka World. So I've built my one in the creation kit. What was a lot harder than I thought would be. My brain came up with a very crazy idea and it worked in the end but I kind of ran out of time and didn't do a lot of decorating because the main attraction what I did kind of took up most of the, most of the time because I had learned scripting and everything like that. Because the creation kit scripting is good but Professor doesn't label everything correctly. So let's get into this. So if you want more I am, I'm in a new cell and it's called Mine Cart Coaster. This was a attempt by Nuka World to buy out an old mine, well they successfully did, and turn it into a theme park attraction by installing a roller coaster. So yeah, kind of worked, kind of didn't. See so they're still doing bits of work here, all the work. Well, it's like they're doing a bit of sign writing. A couple of dead people. Lots of mine carts here. Apologise it's very dark. We didn't really get the power sword correctly throughout the place, as you can tell. We spent about a few days trying to fix all this. Bit smoky, engines knackered, few lights, yeah. Nothing works and not cause. But to get back out, we just use this door to get back out into the world. But this is for the Nuka Dark drink. So Nuka Dark is an alcoholic drink found in the Wild West. So yeah, that's what it's for. So you'd come in here, check in. And then you would go to this ride. But as you can see, a few forklifts, a few rides. I don't know why they had a new cola rocket put on here. I think it was a mistake by the company. I believe these are the original ones that they're going to be putting on. But they're still on their carts, as you can see. So yeah, they never got loaded on. But anyway, I say we take this for a spin. So I zoom out and click this. There you go. We get in. And fingers crossed this does not murder me. Because, well, I have tested this out a few times and it didn't go so well. This is far away. Oh. And be advised, this ride is very bumpy. These tracks are not perfect. They are rotten, rusted, bald bits, and the cart shakes like mad. And while testing and making sure this works, we did lose my head a few times. So fingers crossed this time it goes all okay. Here we go. Oh, hey! Oh jeez, yep, and I went off the top rails again. Yeah, not the senseless cart to have in the world, guys, as you can see. We kind of, oh god, yes. It's very dangerous, this ride. I can't control where I look, because the camera is fixed in location. But as you can see there, it does technically work-ish. And we do get launched around this weird track quite a few times. And we do not fall off it. That's just because, um, well, I never learned it correctly. <laughs> Let's just put it that way, guys. But this was an amazing build challenge in this course. Great fun for me to actually sit and try and learn how to do all this in the creation kits. Oh God. And when the ride is finished, we jump out. Here we go. I will get at this location here. And that ride just goes all the way back around to the start. And this area is still under construction, as you can see. They've got a few number signs, work and scaffolds. Looks like they were getting ready to do work in here, but never got around to it. So yeah, it's a bit dark. We didn't get all the lights in fixed up in time. And some parts of the ceiling is missing for some strange reason. Don't know how that happened, guys. Yes, but guys, this is what I built in the creation kit, if I can actually jump over the railing. There we go. So I'm just going to walk around here. So we took the ride. Well, as you can see, this is just a complete tunnel. And this is a roller coaster ride. What took me quite a few weeks to get to work, because in the creation kit, Bethesda's got this scripting for one of the Nuka World rides, where it gives you a pre -made, well, it gives you a line for the track. It's got scripting what's supposed to go with it, and I have pieced together all the bits of scripting and get this to work then I have re-hand built this rail 
track all the way around, try and match the line the vest gave me. Let's just say I was a hard work. Especially with this. I'm not going to go any further because I know if I go down there, it's tricky to get back out. So I'm going to take a wander back around. Let's see, guys, it's just a, oh no, pff, deep, dark, spooky tunnel. And let me just cheat by using commands. Uh, hold on. Oh, that one didn't go in correctly. There we go. But yeah, this is what I did, guys. Nothing really exciting, too bold or crazy. I would have decorated it more if I had more time. I could say that. But other than that, guys, I'm actually quite happy with how this build challenge turned out. Nice little roller coaster ride to go with. Lovely little build area. Not too crazy, nothing too adventurous. But yeah, that's what I did, guys. I'll go on it one more time and let, and let you just have one last watch of it as I go around. And then after that, I'll do my outro. So let's go one more time. So there we go guys, that is my little roller coaster ride for Colour CI's Discord build challenge of September. But guys, if you have any questions at all about this video, like have I actually built this in creation kit, or you would like to know more about the ride, or anything like that guys, put them in the comments below, I'll try and answer the best of my ability I can guys. And if you do want a video on how I built this, let me know as well in the comments guys, because I will happily make a video about how I made this in the creation kit and the rest. But other than that guys, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down. But until next time guys, I am Victor Barisov, signing off. Until next time guys, bye.